Hello guys and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today we are gonna play Hoggy Q deck and this deck is really good in this meta guys and you can see I have uh, Evolution Tesla right now and I'm using Evolution Tesla and Evo Firecracker in this deck. So let's directly jump into the match and uh, I'm starting with Skellies and I will also go in with Hog. He don't have his log right now so I think we can have some damage with our Skelly guys. Let's see. So Skelly will also help us to take out the cannon and I think our Hog will get one shot and Skelly will also get some damage but it didn't. But that's okay guys, our Skelly did manage to help us out in getting one Hog damage guys. So this guy is also running Hog and uh, that was a really aggressive fireball. And his Hog will get one shot and for that it was I think quite expensive. We can go in with Hog to pressure him and I think this is going to be a cannon. Yes, so indeed it is cannon guys, I will also be uh, aggressive and I will also play my EQ and our hog will manage to get a lot of damage guys, so this way you can use your spell so that you can get a lot of value with that guys. Let's place our Tesla like this. Uh, this guy is running fireball, so it's uh, not gonna be that difficult version for us, but if he would have been using EQ then it would have been a really hard matchup guys with hog cycle when you are against hog eq it totally based on a cycle guys you have to out cycle your opponent really nicely so i will use my eq but this guy is uh, placing his musketeer and uh, evo spirit so that was also a nice defense but our hog did manage to get one shot that's really great and uh, not the best placement of tesla guys and his musketeer will also get one shot but still we are leading with a really big margin so i think we can win this let's go in with hog and let's get ready with our eq let's uh, use it i think our hog will manage to get one shot but it didn't but that's okay guys let's place our tesla we have to place our knight for his musketeer Let's place it like this and uh, now let's go in with our hog guys. Let's do it. And uh, let's uh, cycle our EQ. Our hog will not manage to get any shot. Let's place Tesla guys. I think he will come in with fireball. Let's get uh, ready with our skelly for the musketeer. Wow guys, he did score a lot of damage. But I think now we can win this. Our hog will manage to get one shot. And we can just uh, cycle one log to finish off this game. So that's it guys. GG's. And uh, let's move on to the next one. So we are in the match guys. Up against Jose. So good luck to him. Let's cycle our spirit from the back. And let's go in with our hog. Let's do it. So this guy is running Dagger Duchess and he misplaced his NATO. So I think we can get some damage guys. So that's really great guys. Let's cycle our skellies from the back. Let's see what he is running. Let's place our knight. And uh, this guy will place his uh, executioner. Let's cycle our log. We can get some damage with our firecracker. Let's get some chip really nice so this guy is running a Pekka evolution deck guys and I think we have to defend really nicely let's place our knight over here and I think we should log this back as well okay that was close guys we used up a lot of elixir good defense but a lot of elixir is spent on that defense we can pressure him using our hog. But this time this guy will not miss his nado I think. So this guy is running tesla as well. So there are like 3 counters for hog, nado, tesla and uh, electro wizard. I know pekka is also a really good counter for hog. But uh, these are the cheap counters which can just stop our hog. 
from getting any damage. Let's cycle our log and I think we should place our firecracker to get some chip. Let's see what she will do. Knight will be able to take out uh, the wizard and the firecracker will also get I think one more shot. That's really great. He will place his evolution pekka guys. So now we should get ready for the defense. Let's place our Tesla and uh, let's cycle our log. Let's firecracker over here. He will use his uh, fireball as well. So not a good sign for us. I think we should log this. So he was waiting for this big push all along and still we are leading in damage guys and we can just spell cycle this guy. So we have to defend really nicely from the next time. Let's cycle our EQ. Let's uh, place our Tesla and uh, let's have a fireball. Not sorry, fireball, it's firecracker and let's lock this guys. I think Speka will get the damage on our Tesla. We have to do something about this. Uh, we are barely defending this guys. I miss fireball really badly. Let's go in with Hawk guys. I think now we just uh, win this match. Let's cycle our EQ and uh, let's cycle our log. One more EQ will finish off this game guys. So that's it. Uh, GG's guys. And uh, let's see if we can cycle it on time or not. So that's it guys. GG's and uh, let's move on to the next one. So we are in the match guys and we are up against King Zeus so good luck to him and uh, let's put John our knight from the back for his Valkyrie. I hope he don't have firecracker or else we have to put down our Tesla. Let's place our Skelly. I hope he don't have Zap. So he don't. In the last video Minibega literally destroyed me guys. I think you guys remember. Let's go in with Hog. So this guy indeed have Firecracker. Now I think I can cycle my Firecracker. For the Skelly and the Firecracker which he is coming in with. And he also have Hog guys. So let's place our Tesla. And Princess Tower will take care of the Firecracker. And now I think we can go in with our Hog. And that was a really nice Valkyrie guys. Now I think we can go in with Hog guys to pressure him and I will also support my Hog using uh, Log or Firecracker. Let's do it. So Firecracker will get the damage on top of his uh, mini Pekka and he missed his arrows also guys. So that was uh, really bad and our Firecracker did manage to take care of his mini Pekka. That was a nice skelly placement. So always try to uh, protect your long distance troop guys. They are really valuable for you. They can give you a lot of value. And I think spells are really good on protecting melee troops. We will not get the King Tower activation. I want it. Now I think we can use our Hog and support it using uh, EQ. As I know he will place his uh, cannon or skelly so let's go in with it and let's place our firecracker as well and uh, that was a nice night placement but he have evolution valkyrie guys and uh, she uses a nado to pull the troops in i think we have to do something about that firecracker or else uh, that can get some damage I think we should log this. Maybe it was too much. Maybe. Let's place our Tesla. And uh, I think this time this hog will get some damage guys. We have to stop this from getting any damage. And uh, that was close actually. Let's log this. Let's get the King Tower activation. Let's put down our knight and... Uh, doing great up until now let's cycle our tesla let's log this one nice log for us guys we need skelly right now i think he will use his arrows oh this guy is also running zap 
I didn't saw it coming, guys. I think our hog is going to be wasted. Let's place our Tesla, guys. And uh, Evolution Tesla is really nice. I really love this card. And uh, the death damage and the first initial wave damage that really cool actually it blocks the troops which uh, are coming towards your princess tower and we did got some after damage of uh, firecracker on the princess tower that was great let's place our knight and uh, i think we should put down our firecracker let's cycle our eq guys we are in 3x elixir right now so we can have some Liberty in doing that and uh, he did manage to cycle his cannon Let's place our Tesla and uh, let's log this Let's place our Skelly guys. We have to stop this anyhow and uh, let's go in with log as well. So evolution Valkyrie is coming in guys. We have to do something about this Let's uh, stop this hog from getting any damage and uh, let's place our skelly over here. So it's the last 10 seconds of the match guys so GG's and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more such contents guys and thanks a lot for watching guys and thank you for showing your love and support. So see you in the next video. Bye bye. Take care.